Hey y'all, welcome to my channel, Plant Based Storm. I'm Stormy, and today I thought that I would show you what was going on in the garden and show you what kind of vegetables we're getting out of it and what we're doing with it. So let's go ahead and check it out. Just close your eyes and let them rest. I know it's hard fall asleep but do your best cause there's a place that I go to when I want to hide from all the shades of blue I'm in your garden as a tale just feel the wind if you look close you see the lilies dance and how they slowly grow I'm counting years as they go by Now all the lilies gone and aces brought to life I'm in your garden as a tale As you can see, we're getting tons of radishes and there's a lot of greens that I've got going in the garden. There's a large variety of kale. There are um, mustard greens, the Southern Giant, the Japanese Purple, which are beautiful, Japanese Purple mustard greens. We've got some turnip greens and collards, so um, also Swiss chard and I've got some beets growing in there and some carrots that came up and I transplanted some cabbage and um, Brussels sprouts the other day, which I didn't actually have those in the garden whenever I filmed it um, But hopefully those will go ahead and take off um, We've just really been enjoying this fall garden and I'm going to be cooking up a really simple dish that hopefully will inspire you um, To use your own garden or check out a local um, Farmers market or buy some produce and use it in a way that you hadn't maybe thought of before So for this dish, we've, it's kind of made up of two parts. We're going to use the radishes and I'm going to put in some potatoes and other things and just season it up with some broth. There's no rhyme or reason to the measurements. Just um, kind of go with the flow and put in what you think needs to be in there. Now I do use the broth to help roast these things, but I'm actually going to cut up the radishes and roast them along with potatoes. Oh, and some of our beautiful little carrots that we thinned out. Um, so that the other carrots could grow to their actual size. Um, so we're going to have some tiny little cute baby carrots, but they're going to be just as delicious. And then for this next part, we just simply washed and cleaned the greens and pulled them apart, stripped them from the stem. And um, we're gonna add in some broccoli and asparagus and mushroom and saute that all up. And this is gonna give us a nice, delicious 50-50 plate inspired by fall. Thank you. 
that's it for this simple, delicious, easy garden recipe. I hope that you enjoyed this. It was something different that I'd been wanting to show you, and I love sharing my garden with you guys. So I hope that this inspires you to try something new with fall produce. If you like this video, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, thanks so much for watching. Thank you.